in the Dominican Republic, we start from sugar cane. First, the sugar is extracted and then you obtain the bagasse. This is our starting raw material. And it's raw material with plenty of potential. At this factory in Belgium, a new breed of products is being developed from the fibrous remains of sugar cane. This woody material is cooked at high temperature. And from the cooking of this material, you get this. It's a pure chemical. And this is called furfural. It smells like almonds. And this is the basis of our new, new products. So we have a, a full polymer form of, uh, of furfural alcohol and we impregnate various substrates with it. The bioresin made by Transfurance Chemicals aims to be a more sustainable and environmentally friendly replacement for oil-based plastics. The first example is, is the interior market. There we make uh, decorative high-pressure laminates. We also made co components for, from the automotive industry, so this is also uh, bioresin molded at high temperature, but here we replaced the paper with a, a natural fiber. The uh, resin structure also reinforces the textile, and the textile still biodegrades, but much, much, much more slowly than this does. So you have uh, several seasons of service life of this textile before it starts disintegrating into the soil structure. Here we actually replace standard thermoplastics like polyethylene. This bioresin technology has been developed over the course of several EU research projects. An input and testing from universities has helped to create products that are ready for market. The next step is identifying the right sectors to target with your new green materials. Products from biomass is interesting. It is nice to have an eco or a bio label on your product, but it's most of the time not enough. You have to bring more added value to the market. Jump in my machine, feel the speed growing. You are the first to test.